Okay, so welcome to the seventh part of the complete MX Simulator tutorial slash guide. Today we're going to look at the playback race function. But we want to have a something we want to play back, so let's go and create something that we want perhaps want to save or play back or you know. So I'm just going to go and do a whip and pretend that it's the best whip I've ever done and I want to save it. Okay so hey that was my best whip. We can pretend so what we want to do is um, go to playback race and go to the default. Default is the last race you've raced that goes for online races too, but not time trial. Uh, so let's go to playback race. So here we start off in a third person view, or the view we last, we last have. Uh, I can change it to free view by click tab, and first person by clicking tab again. So that was the first person um, cam. So here we have some keys. Uh, let's go to Casmaze controls. We have the uh, skip step, rewind, and skip. I have the step on space um, because it's easiest since I read with controller. Either you can just have the colon or the one that kind of looks like that one or whatever you want so let's go back to the whip um, we may want to have a third person so uh, I steer with my left joystick where I have left and right to move forward I use the throttle uh, which is my left trigger and to move right trigger uh, and to move backwards you use the front brake which is my right bumper uh, you can center the camera by pressing A that that will center or press uh, sit to center the camera to the rider we'll press play again and there we have the whip so go ahead and open up fraps or whatever you want to record with and um, you can also change the field of view to get a perhaps nicer look of the jump. So, and if you use uh, the step button you shows, you can do it in slow motion. Okay, so you can see it was not the best whip ever, but it is something to work with at least. If fail of me. So that's the whip. Um, that's pretty much how you play back a race. And um, if you race multiplayer with robots you can use the forward and backward change bike to see other people but this is pretty much everything. Uh, when you're in the uh, playback mode you have some commands which I will cover in the next um, uh, next part. Uh, I really recommend to watch it because it's a quite important part where you can actually name demos so you won't just have the default without you can have big whip on x one b Park or whatever you want to name it. But that will be in next episode. However, if you kind of close down the game or started a new race and you reminded and thought of oh shit man I had this big ass whip last race um, what you want to do then is do not uh, close down the game or m create a new race or whatever what you want to do is go to a folder uh, I'll show you now so the folder you want to go to is um, the personal folder. Not the C folder, but the personal folder. 
I have MXS here. Hope you close down. And here's a folder called demos. You go into here. We have the default demo. Uh, you can copy this one, like copy, uh, paste onto your desktop or whatever. And yeah, I accidentally open it up, but now you can perhaps see what's happening. So if you double click it, it will open with MX Simulator. Uh, but you can also change the name like moosh underscore whip. Um, so that is kind of quickly how you playback demos and a little bit of how you do it. Uh, next part is going to be commands uh, offline, online and playback like the kind of key commands to the game. So see you in part 8.